And once again with style points, they're all chasing the last style better now. Congratulations on just an epic result and performance tonight. And I said, I wanted to do service to the middleweight division, and that's a hard act to follow. Rematches are always compelling. The following question, what is going to be different? There's a rematch with Whitaker. That's a big fight. Whitaker's looked amazing ever since uh, Stylebender knocked him out. You know, and uh, maybe with a different approach, it could be a different fight. So, you know, the rematch with Whitaker, that's the fight that needs to happen next. Uh, Bobby Knuckles, I knocked him out twice at one fat last night. I don't know what the is gonna happen with this whole COVID, but we need to run that back in Auckland. We need to run that back in my territory this time. Maybe back in America somewhere, but it would be so awesome if it was in Auckland and I could do it in my home turn. You are looking at the undisputed greatest middleweight in the world at present. Nothing broken about this broken native tonight. All you wanted was a chance to prove you were the best middleweight in the world and in less than two years on this UFC roster, you have done just that. And still the number one contender, the former undisputed middleweight champion. Dean, now you have two wins over credentialed contenders inside of three months. You're already the guy with the number one next to your name. Very all class, one of the best middleweights in the world. The former champ getting it done tonight. Hey, y'all must have forgot. Y'all must have forgot. Trust me, I had to make y'all remember. One way or another, we will all witness a piece of UFC history. This is Von Klaus with shit, total fucking war. You are looking at the undisputed greatest middleweight in the world at present, Israel Adesanya. We the best. That's one of the best middleweights in the world. The former champ getting it done tonight. The Reaper, Robert Whitaker. It's time! I know you guys got me.